Food insecurity, sometimes referred to as food poverty, is the state of being without reliable access to a sufficient quantity of affordable, nutritious food. Humanity First UK has been playing its part in tackling food insecurity with its two food banks in Yorkshire and the Midlands regions. Across the United Kingdom, there are currently over 2,500 food banks serving thousands of families in need. Even before the COVID pandemic, over 4 million children were living in poverty. That's nine in every classroom of 30. It is estimated that between 8 to 9% of the UK population is affected by food poverty. Food poverty can be triggered by a crisis in finances or personal circumstances. It can also be a long-term experience of not being able to access or have the facilities to prepare a healthy diet. For example, low wages that do not cover the cost of living or a disability that prevents an individual from accessing healthy food as needed. There are many examples of situations where people require help from a food bank, such as children unable to access free school meals during the holidays, families using food banks for the first time after a job loss, parents on low incomes, or older people unable to prepare meals without support. Economic challenges with increased living costs, rising debt, and financial problems for households have all exacerbated the situation. The huge rise in demand has put strains on food banks around the country, and the Humanity First teams have also witnessed major pressures on their services, especially over the winter period. Managers at both Humanity First food banks reported a massive increase in demand and expect the situation to sadly get worse over the coming year. They also reported that rising food and energy costs were having a serious effect on many of their clients and families that they support. Nadim Ahmed from the Murfield Food Bank said, The situation is really difficult at the moment, and our volunteers and donors are each trying their very best to serve as best as we can. Dr Azhar Sadiq from the Walsall Food Bank reported, We are expecting a significant increase in demand over the winter period.